guys, welcome back. I know that we took forever and I know that you guys have been asking for more and more videos. So just wanted to let you guys know that we were really busy doing events and whatnot. But as you can see, the video quality has improved greatly. So let's just get straight to it. In our last video, we talked about some of the things that you're gonna need to become a professional DJ. In this video, we're gonna talk about the prices of those items that we talked about last time. Okay, first things first, let's talk about the turntables. In our last video, we talked about a pair of Technique vinyl turntables, which are pretty good for scratching if that's what you're looking for. In this video, we're gonna talk about our Pioneer CDJs. These we found to be a little better when it comes to blending. Now, if you're gonna buy these used, you're gonna spend around $600 or so on eBay. If you want them new, you're gonna have to part with at least $900. Now, as far as the mixer is concerned, you have many different options. A professional DJ will most likely have two mixers, one for professional use and the other practicing at home. We're going to go over three of our mixers today. The first one is the Pioneer DJM 400 mixer. This mixer has two line-in channels and two phono channels, bringing it up to a total of four usable channels. This mixer is perfect for practicing at home since you will only be using two channels anyways. The crossfader is very smooth as with all Pioneer mixers, making it a great mixer for scratching. We found this on eBay for $400. The next mixer is the Behringer DJX750, which is perfect for that advanced DJ looking for up to 8 channels to connect to. It comes with a few built-in effects as well, and you can find it for around $125, which is not bad at all. This will come in handy in big events like weddings and sweet 16s where you will definitely, definitely need more than just a two channel mixer. And last on our list is the Pioneer DJM 600. This mixer has the same number of plugins as the Behringer. The difference is that the mixer has a lot more effects and essentially the mixer is top of the line quality while the 750 is a bit on the cheap side. This mixer will go for about $500. Now for our DJing mixing software, we prefer to use Serato Scratch Live, which you can find used for about $300. Our laptops are MacBook Pros, which run for about $1,300, or if you're not willing to spend that money yet, PC laptops go for around $400 and up. All right, now let's talk headphones. We're using the Dr. Dre Beat Pros, which are $400, but you can use regular headphones if you're just starting out and you wanna work your way up. And finally, to practice, any regular stereo system will do. And they can be as inexpensive as $80. Okay guys, that's it for this episode. Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Twitter at RoombaENT. Also, if you want, check out our event photography on our Facebook.